Hey Divas, so in today's video, I'm here to share with you guys this fabulous unit that I'm rocking right now. So if you guys are interested, then go ahead and stay tuned. Okay Divas, so before we get right into this video, I wanted to let you guys know that this video is being brought to you guys by So Good Shop. Thank you So Good Shop for sponsoring this video. I greatly appreciate it. But yeah Divas, let's go ahead and jump right in. I do want to warn you guys that this video is going to be longer because this unit is different. As you guys can tell from the title, it is the Outre Vixen wig. Um, I know this wig has been out for for quite a while but I wanted to give you guys an in-depth detailed review and show and tell on this unit just to let you guys know how I feel and how I feel like you can work with the unit or how I feel that was best for me to work with the unit let me say that but yeah so the unit we have today is the Outre Swiss X lace front wig we have it in the style Vixen Yaki and I have her in the color number 1B so yeah do was without further ado let's go ahead and get right into the details and the specs. Na, na, na. So now that you guys have gotten all the details and the specs, I'm here to tell you guys how I feel about this unit. So um, I hope it's not too disappointing that you guys are not seeing me do like a half up, half down style or the four ponytails, two ponytails, whatever. It's just that I just recently reviewed the blowout version of this unit and that got to be glue like really have had my head hurting and it had my head hurting for about three hours like i don't know if it was because it was like i don't know it's like the product like sucked to my head i do not have that problem with the black one but i just wanted to give my edges as well as my head a rest so please i hope that you would not be disappointed i did show you guys how the unit can be styled when i showed you guys the cap construction and everything so i hope that was enough for you guys but yeah so let's go ahead and talk about the cap construction so um i did have some cons with this one for the cap construction um in the back it scrunches up um even it wasn't just on my head it was actually on my wig head so i'm not sure if that's like because my wig head is big my wig head is a couple inches well not a couple of inches it's a little bit bigger than my normal size well my head but it's not that much bigger and now i'm noticing that the wig is also scrunching up as well so i don't know if that's like because I have a big head or what but that was like a con for me because I saw it laying flat on everybody else so I don't know if it's just my unit or what. Another con that I had was that there is flyaways like in the middle um, when I parted it up into the four ponytails I noticed that on this side there was some flyaways like some shorter hairs and they weren't like filler hairs they were like maybe about this long and then they were just like popping up everywhere so i had to kind of tame those so that i can show you guys like how it looks so that was another con um other than that i do really like the cap construction you guys already saw that it has more than enough security on this unit so i really do like that the last con that i had is this line of demarcation here you guys may not be able to see it um but it is a line of demarcation here 
and um, I believe one of my YouTube sisters did a video on it so I'm gonna have to go and check out her video and see how she fixed it but um yeah like this unit did have a lot of cons with the cap construction however I'm not like roasting them because this was like the first time anybody has made a unit like this um you know especially in the synthetic wig category so I'm not roasting them but I am just giving my honest opinion okay so here is some of the hairs I was talking about I just noticed and looked at it so as you guys can see it's just like a short hair and if it's not tame it's just gonna stick up so let's put that back down let's put that back down okay so as far as the texture on this hair i absolutely love it it's like a really silky yakky type of texture now i wouldn't say that this is like completely yakky i'm not gonna sit here and tell you that this is like one of those yakis that could be close to your hair if you do have a coarser hair type like myself but it is a really nice texture um, I absolutely love silky yakky textures because it is still believable but at the same time like it's not super yakky um, you know it's it's a silky yakky as far as shedding and tangling I did experience some shedding and I did not experience any tangling which is absolutely amazing because that's the last thing we need is tangling, especially with a unit like this that you can put in multiple styles. Um, but the shedding was, you know, it was it was there. So um, you can't expect to experience a little bit of shedding with this unit. As far as the parting areas, I absolutely love the parting areas. I didn't even go in and add powder or anything. I didn't do that because I'm not actually going to wear this unit out today. Um, I am going to be wearing it um, in the future, but just not today because I don't have the time to tend to it and everything and style it like I would really want to. So I'm not going to do that. But however, the parting area is really nice. I did notice that the hairline on this one is a lot nicer. As you guys can see, um, I don't know if I'm going to keep that part in, but I did go in and add a little bit of baby hair but once I remembered the headache that I had for hours I was just like nope we're not putting anything on these edges like I'm giving my edges a break but this one does have a lot better hairline than the other one I don't know if it's just me but um or just my unit but it does have a better hairline which I was really super duper happy about so in this video you may have seen me leave a lot a significant amount of lace on the unit and that's just basically because once you lift up the unit and you style it um it will cause for it to lay down instead of it like lifting up and i did get that method from miss chrissy j i don't know if i mentioned that in my last previous video but i did get that method from her so um yeah you guys should always leave like if you want your lace to lay down and you're gonna style it because i am gonna style this unit in the future you do want to leave a little bit of lace that just allows the support so that it can lay down when you cut all the lace off it has no support and it has nothing to help it to lay down if that makes any sense unless you apply some glue or the got to be glue gel as far as the length goes i think that this is about an 18 to 20 inch it does go like almost to my waist like not quite so I would say that it's about 18 to a 20 inch um bear in mind I am 5'2 and I do have a shorter neck so everything varies on you know you um, as far as the density I think that it has like a it has like a natural density so it's not too thin and it's not too thick so it, it has that natural perfect density overall i would give this unit a six out of ten um just because of the cap malfunctions now it may just be my unit i'm not too sure but um yeah i mean overall i do think it's a nice unit just because of course it's game changing to the wig game i mean you know we don't have any units that has this vixen parting so i'm definitely not knocking it but at the same time like you know there is things that need to be improved which is to be expected because this is the first of its kind but yeah divas that's pretty much it because i know this video is probably kind of kind of long i'm sorry you guys i just want to get in depth and tell you guys all the details and the specs on this unit and let you guys know how i feel about it and the pros and the cons but anyways that's pretty much all i have 
um, I want to go ahead and thank So Good Shop for sending me out this fabulous unit. And be sure to go ahead and check the description box below. I will be having links to where you can purchase this unit. And I will be having links to So Good Shop. Definitely check them out. They are an online beauty supply store and they have all your beauty supply store needs and more. So be sure to go ahead and check them out. All that will be in the description box. But yeah, Divas, thank you guys so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you guys did enjoy this video, then go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Be sure to go ahead and leave me a comment down below. I would love to hear from you lovely divas. Let me know if you have this unit, how you work with this unit. Give me some tips because I can always learn something new every day. But yeah, just tell me how you feel. Are you going to get this unit? Just talk to me divas. And be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And also hit the notification bell. I do upload quite often so you definitely do not want to miss any of my videos. But yeah, divas, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. And I will see you lovely divas in my next video. Bye.